Snow. 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 It's only mid-October and there is so much snow already. It's cold. Man, was that a sketchy drive. Okay, I'm going to see some friends right now because I haven't seen them in a really, really long time and it's nice just to catch up a little bit. Man, I love seeing people. Every time I see someone that I haven't seen in such a long time, it just makes me so happy. Okay, it is currently 4 o'clock. I was supposed to make it home at 4, but uh, that's okay. I will figure out how to make up for the lost time later. Such a good mood now. Home. Finally home. Okay, I'm going to try to implement what I learned yesterday to today's study session. I hope it goes well. I shouldn't be drinking this this late in the day. It's currently four o'clock. I am one third, actually wait, is it four o'clock? Oh shit, it's five o'clock. It's five o'clock and I am currently one third of the way done studying. And so far, this study method is yielding really good progress. I feel like I'm having a deeper understanding of the material that I didn't have before. Although this is some pretty simple material. So it's gonna be interesting to see how well this method holds with harder material. All right, got keep going. I do a I think I finally got it back. Not this, this is just a to-do list of why I still need to study. I think why I have back is momentum. So right before I got sick, I felt like I had momentum. Starting things and getting things done had never felt easier than before, except then travel happened and then right after I got back, I got sick and that momentum just slowly died as my life kind of fell into disarray again. And after struggling for a few days to recover, I feel like I'm at a better place than I was before I got sick. I'm still not 100% better yet. I still have a slight fever, but that's not stopping me. All right. Funny story, so as most of you know, when I first started this channel, I put a lot of emphasis on trying to monetize my work, but then shortly after realizing how difficult it is to grow a channel and subsequently monetize your videos, I kind of gave up on that and shifted all of my focus to creating really good work. But now that my work has reached a level where it's somewhat consistent and there's some kind of professionalism to it, it's definitely the wrong word, I'm shifting more of my focus back to monetization. This kind of lends itself hand in hand because good work naturally lends itself to monetization. Um, it's only because in a year from now, I want to be somewhere else. I've gotten a taste of what building a community feels like, and there is nothing that I enjoy more in life than talking to people and learning about their perspectives. So the bigger I can grow this community, the more perspectives I can absorb and learn from. So that is the goal. I would be lying if I didn't mention the fact that getting paid for your work is a little bit nice. So from today on out, expect these vlogs to be at the same quality as they were before, maybe a little bit better, but also expect movies because up until now, these vlogs are really temporary. I need something that has legs, something that appeals to a broader audience. By doing so, I think that'll be the fastest way to grow this channel. I'm not sure if that's how it's going to work, but... We'll find out. Okay, enough with saying what I'm going to do and time to actually do it. First thing, I gotta clean up this room. It is the perfect representation of how I'm feeling right now. A total mess. It's just in my body. Make it comfy. Give it to you properly. When you own sleep in the morning, make you coffee. Baby, when you gonna leave, grab your friends a coffee. Do it 
my room is now in a more acceptable condition. There are still little pockets of mess like here and there, as well as my desk, but things are coming along nicely. I have one last thing before bed. While I was cleaning, my email kind of blew up and I originally thought that maybe my last video did really good, but it's actually much more depressing. It's just a bunch of spam. And I'm not sure if these people realize that by responding to the spam, they're also spamming everybody else. As annoying as spam is, the reason why it gets sent out is because it works. Not primarily on my generation, but I think they have a higher success rate on like my grandparents or people of that age. So if you have loved ones and they're old, just remind them to not believe this stuff. Be cautious, be, but you're